What is up guys, welcome back to the channel. So our good friends over at Hiker shot us over a pair of their S1 Sport earphones for us to take a look at right here on the channel. So that is what we're gonna be doing in this video today. Now first and foremost, I do gotta say thank you to them for actually sending it out because you guys know that I appreciate any and everything we get on this channel that I can share with you guys. And if tech tips, tutorials, reviews and unboxings is something that you're into, then you might as well go ahead and subscribe to the channel right now. That way you can be a part of helping this channel grow. Let's get to it. All right, you guys, so if you are looking for these, you can find them right here on Amazon. I will throw a link in the description. The price is $39.99, and there is a 10% off coupon as well. Uh, like I said, once again, these are the Hiker Audio S1 Wireless Bluetooth Earbuds right here, guys. So uh, just scrolling through real quick. This is a quick picture of what they're going to look like. We got some inline controls. We got IPX5 waterproof. What else we got? We got a uh, Bluetooth 5.0. One, we got 11 hours of play time. Uh, got magnetic suction so that you can connect the uh, headphones just like that. Uh, what else we got? Hi-Fi stereo uh, sound quality. And uh, right here just says a uh, quick uh, product display, uh, basically showing everything that's gonna come in the box. Uh, and with that being said, let's go ahead and get to the box. All right, so once you open it up, right here on the left side, it says performance that lasts, has a nice little uh, picture of the headphones right here. We got the headphones showing right there as well. Uh, right here we got a little box and it looks like under the box we might have a user manual of some sort yep got a user manual right here uh, in the box is where we'll put that back uh, in this little box right here got some hiker audio uh, branding on it uh, but once you open this bad boy up uh, you got a nice little uh, carrying bag looks like so we got a carrying bag right here and right here we have a bag full of ear tips I have a bag full of ear tips and a charger so let's get these out right here as well. So these are all of the uh, actual ear tips that you're gonna have right here on the side. We'll move that out the way. Uh, and then last but not least, we got uh, the actual uh, headphones themselves right here. So let's get this plastic off and we'll just look at these real quick. Let's move this out of the way. So we got the actual headphones. Cord is pretty long, as you can see. Uh, this is what the uh, actual headphones look like. They got that magnetic clasp right here, so if you drip them around your neck, you will be good to go. This is where you uh, put your USB in right here to charge it up right there. We got the uh, volume up and down, inline controls. This is a braided cable, and it doesn't move. We got some Hiker Audio branding going on right here as well. Um, but just off the rip, they feel pretty good. I like this braided cable. Uh, that just lets you know that that's not going to tear up anytime soon. Uh, but I like what they look like. They got a little bit of weight to them. Uh, they look real, real nice. All right, guys, so give me a hot minute. I'm going to listen to a couple songs, probably watch a couple quick YouTube videos because I still got a little bit of time left here at work. And uh, we'll come back and we'll finish talking about these. Give me about, you know, my last 30 to 45 minutes real quick. Be right back. All right, guys, so we're tapping right back in, man. It's been about 40 to 45 minutes. I am off work now. I was listening to some YouTube, listening to some music and so forth and so on. I got one of them in my ear right now because I want you guys to be able to see what it looks like. I didn't have to change out the ear tips or anything. Um, I do think that these headphones sound really good. I like that little clasp to clasp to I'm sorry. I do think that they sound really uh, good. The inline controls work. And as far as pairing these up to your phone, all you do is hold the uh, power button on them. Uh, the blue light will come on going to your Bluetooth and you just connect them just like that. Now, they do sound good. They are bass heavy on certain songs. I listen to a little bit of jazz. I listen to some trap music, some hip hop music. I mean, I just went down the line. I even listened to a few of the uh, tracks that I've actually created myself. And the bass can be heavy at times, depending on what the song is. However, if you are, you know, just listening to something uh, that's not like a super bass heavy song, then you'll be perfectly fine. I do believe in my heart that the, I think the Hiker T1s, I think we did those on the channel. I kind of feel like these sound better than those, but I'll do a little comparison of those uh, here in the future for you guys. But I do kind of feel that they do sound a little bit better, but I do need to go back and listen to, you know, the T1s. I think they were the T1s. I need to go back and listen to the T1s and listen to these again just to kind of get, you know, just to kind of refresh my memory. But I feel like these might sound better. Uh, but just keep in mind, the bass is heavy. If you are listening to a bass heavy song, it is real heavy on these. So, you know, um, I didn't have any issues with going up above 100%. They didn't hurt my ears or anything like that. So I do feel that what you get for the price um, uh, with these headphones, I think it's a pretty good deal. Um, if you're not into
to the whole, you know, around your neck type of headphones, then these obviously wouldn't be for you. If you're just more into the traditional nowadays, the earbuds, the wireless ones like that, then those, these wouldn't be for you. Uh, but if you are into this style and it doesn't matter, if you want to go to the gym, you want to rock these around and not really worry about having them keep them in your ear at all times or putting them back in the case, then that's what these are going to be good for. And with that being said, let's go ahead and wrap this video up. Now, if you found this video to be helpful in some way, don't forget to subscribe to the channel and don't forget to hit that like button so the YouTube algorithm can be nice to this video. It's been your man Jay and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.